My name is Cody Baker. I'm co-founder and chief technology officer of Velometro Mobility. Velometro Mobility is looking to redefine how people take short distance trips in an urban center. So you have less cars sitting around in traffic. Improved quality of the air and improved health of the population. Studies have shown that up to 60% of a city's population in a dense urban environment would like to cycle more, but they don't right now because they don't want to be exposed to the elements. They're afraid of riding in traffic. They don't have any room for storage. So we've developed an enclosed electric assist three-wheeled vehicle, the VMO, which really solves all those issues. An electric assist bike is one that has pedals like a bike, but as you pedal, we add the strength of two Olympic athletes through our motors. So it makes you feel superhuman because you're driving this small car around at 30 kilometers per hour through your own leg power. It's providing a car-like experience, but it's regulated as a bicycle. So you don't need a driver's license, you don't need insurance. Because you have access to the bike lanes, you're not stuck in traffic. We really designed Vimo from the ground up to be directed towards sharing networks so that you can rent it by the minute. So you use your cell phone, you find the vehicle that's closest to you, unlock it with the app, you get in, you enter your PIN number, and then you're good to go. The state of technology and software today has really enabled Velometro to exist. It's allowed us to do a lot of digital prototyping and crash test simulation and virtual wind tunnel testing and really allow us to build the vehicle right the first time. This coming winter, we're going to be releasing five vehicles in the first publicly available sharing fleet out of the University of British Columbia. We're gonna really be able to see the life that they take on for themselves. So we're gonna learn a lot from that and then we're going to be able to leverage that usage data with new investment and then launch into Vancouver. Our big goal is to have a massive effect on how cities have short trips being completed. We just think that there's huge benefits around the world for that.